Let's talk about the Larson & Bruce Guard Quattro Audible Altimeter, shall we? This video is sponsored by Shooting Star. This unique family business is now a blend of parachute rigging, skydiving expert advice blog, online and walking skydiving gear store located in Marietta, Georgia. Their mission is to help you find the best skydiving gear so that you are making the most of your weekends at the drop zone. I have myself used them a couple of times and I was more than pleased with the hassle-free order and delivery through their website. Moreover, you can get a special price discount by using the code SKYDIVEVIBESHELPEDME when you order. And so check their gear and services out at shootingstar.com slash skydive. Hey there, this is Catherine Bernier with Skydive Vibes, sharing the passion of skydiving and helping you become a better and safer skydiver. So if you're new here, consider subscribing not to miss our weekly videos all about skydiving, where time to time we do gear reviews just like in this one. All right, so I was getting a little bit tired of that timeout audible altimeter where I could set only one altitude. I decided to get myself an audible altimeter from Larson & Bruce Guard, a Quattro. You will be able to find the link to the Quattro in the description below, as well as the coupon code to get a special discount on Shooting Star, which is Skydive Vibes Helped Me. So first, let's unbox it. <sighs> Now that's interesting, a candy, a sour candy inside my box, really cool. That's it, the Quattro from Larson Brisgard. Really excited to have this unit in my hand. I'm looking forward to learn how to use it. I have been begging for an audible altimeter with a screen so that I can set it up in the plane and set up more than one alarms. So really happy about this unit. So talking about some specs, you should know that the Quattro has three climb to altitude alarm, four high speed alarms, which is an interesting feature I'm gonna talk about later on, three low speed alarms, four memory banks, meaning that you can have up to four presets depending on the type of skydives you're gonna do. And this is true for the high speed alarms. So you have up to four presets for the high speed alarms and then four presets for the low speed alarms. A particular feature of this audible altimeter is that you have a track guide, which is really interesting when you're more into formation skydiving uh, and big formations where you need to be aware of different tracking groups of the formation. It's water resistant with an IP64, meaning it cannot be submerged into water, but it can stand sprinkle of waters, which is good. And it uses CR2325 batteries that you can see at the back here. And you can get one on the Shooting Stars website for about $279 US. Now, why did I choose the Quattro over the Optima 2, over the Solo 2, over the Pro Track? By the way, I did a comparison video between the four possible audible altimeters from Larson and Brisgard, and you can watch it by clicking right here. And so my choice turned out to be the Quattro. And the main reason is that when the Optima 2 with the swoop guide is more for canopy piloting, the Quattro is more for formation skydiving, which is what I'm more into. So this is why I went with the Quattro. I wanted that extra high speed alarm. Like I said at the beginning, I'm really thrilled to have a screen on it so that I can use it and change it in the plane before jumping. So if for some reason I just forget to set my warning altitudes before getting into the plane, I still have a last shot to make it work. I already have the Viso 2 from Larson and Bruce Guard, and so I know their products are high quality and reliable. Plus dealing with Shooting Star for 
the order and delivery through their website, well, that made everything hassle-free. Now, last thing I wanted to check is the fit in my helmet, so let's do this. The fit is now confirmed. It's pretty comfortable with a Cookie G3, so no problem in that. Now I need to figure out how to make everything work and how to set my alarms using their roadmap. It's, it's supposed to be really, really simple. So what I'll do is that I'm gonna learn it and then share with you what I learned in the simplest way I've found to set everything up. So if you're looking for a quattro, you will find this video really useful. So stay tuned for that and make sure to subscribe not to miss anything. On that, I hope you've liked this video. Give it a thumbs up if so. And let me know in the comments below if you have any question about the quattro or if you want me to review any other skydiving products. Thanks again to Shooting Star for making this video possible. So keep jumping, stay safe and blue skies. And I'll see you in the next one.